Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Ark Survival Evolve, and today is the day. It is a day of building, which can always be a struggle in Ark, but here we are. We're going to give it a shot. So I have brought Shaggy along with us. He has some of our building materials, but off camera, I have spent a whole bunch of time gathering, clearing out this area, gathering a bunch of resources in these three here and then building everything that i need for the house that i want to build now the house that i'm building is actually based on and pretty much modeled directly after another youtuber um i love watching all of his uh building tutorials uh so feel free to check him out um i'll put his uh name uh in the description of this video um but uh, aaron longstaff uh, does a lot of cool arc building videos um and so i'm going to be modeling mine pretty much directly off of his um so with building uh also comes leveling up and we now have the ability to ride on the back of Achilles. So we have made the saddle. We have fitted it to Achilles. Ajax, we are level 72. Only two more levels to go before we can pull the saddle on Ajax and really get him leveled up. Um, but uh, so, yeah. Um, as always, when building, um, it is always wise to lay out your foundations and where you want to build with thatch as it is the cheapest and easiest uh resource uh to uh build with so i've already gone ahead and laid out my foundations and made sure that i'm going to be able to um uh build uh, everything i need uh for uh, my house here um so now all i have to do is go through and um, and you know what, we're just gonna do this. Um, now I just have to go through and uh, replace all of these foundations with stone. Um, but uh, if you want to see uh, the pattern and, and how to build, oh my gosh, see this is why you always build extra. Um, see how to actually build the um, house that I'm building um, like I said I'll put the link to it in the description of this video um, but uh, it's a 5 by 10 house um, and it uses a combination of stone and wood which is you know what we need to do in order to upgrade and look a little bit more modern than our uh, little starter base that we had uh, over yonder over there um, So I'm really excited to get this done now. I'm not gonna go through and Show you guys You know oh, Perfect. I built one extra and we needed it. I'm not gonna go through and show you exactly um, What I'm going to be doing when it comes to building uh, these uh, I'm more so just going to kind of pop in and out um, of the video to kind of let you guys see hang on I wanted some of those kind of let you see the building process um, so the number one thing is that uh, when building in vanilla which is you know the non modded arc when you look at stone pillars um, they don't really they don't snap to corners they snap to the edges and the center. So in order to get a pillar in the corner of a foundation, what we have to do instead is use these fence foundations and place them into our stone foundation. So as you can see right right there, um, you can see the, the wood sticking out. So then that allows us to put a stone pillar on the edge uh, as opposed to um, you know being limited to uh, right in the middle um, of each foundation so um, 
what I'm going to go ahead and do is lay out the uh, basic structure of the uh, house uh, so that you guys can see. And actually, you know what? I think we're going to go ahead and get because we're going to need this to. We're going to go ahead and get our stone dino gateway. Check our food here. Uh, we're pretty good. So we're going to continue to let that cook. But I'm going to go ahead and get the framework laid out for our house. And uh, then I will be right back. All right. So we have the basic uh, framework laid out of the, of the house here. We have... Um, We've got all the pillars placed where we need them to go. We have the dino gate for our front door up and ready to roll. Uh, so the next thing that we need to do is we need to go around and we need to place walls all the way around the bottom floor. That was a little faster than my fingers could handle there. Now, oop, that's not what I want. Um, I want to make sure that we're on the actual foundation edge there. And then, um, we're gonna have to put, oops, I believe, you know what, we're gonna hold off there. But, that's essentially what we need all the stone for, uh, and then pretty much everything else is going to be built out of, um, out of wood. Um, so what we need to do at this point is we need to take Shaggy here, back or brown, and we need to get ourselves some of our wooden, wooden items here. So we're going to take... Okay, I can still walk. That's good. Um, and you know what? Because we don't need them, I'm just going to get rid of these tools and all of this extra stuff that we're not going to be using. Here. Put the hide and fiber here as well. Alright, so actually we want to be back in there. Um, what else are we going to need? We've got the stone pillars in there uh, we're gonna need some ramps uh we'll take the wooden pillars and how are you looking for weight shaggy if i give you those what do you have for weight? oh you're not bad so maybe we can give you some more wooden walls for that that's not too much is it uh, it's pretty heavy um, and how about half of the stone ceilings? Can you take those? Please? Can you take those? Eh, not bad. Okay. So let's have, because I bet if I, uh, yeah, he's actually probably not going to like it. Um, I'll take the ceilings then. And then you just follow me. So we'll hop on back over here. Shaggy's essentially our mobile supply guy right now. So we're going to thank you, little Dodo. Bring him a background here. So, okay. So basic framework and how this is going to work, and you'll see it more take shape. But essentially, this is going to be our main uh, working area. And then over here, we're going to have a ramp going up. Um, and then our second floor is going to be more of the uh, advanced things such as the fabricator and the grill and all of those kind of things. Um, but this main area here is going to be uh, where the smithy and the forges and those kind of things are all going to be located. Lots of storage. Um, and I will eventually color code. I've done it in the past on uh, servers, 
but color coat storage containers so that uh, um, we know where everything is located. So I'm gonna continue to keep working on this. Um, and uh, when I have a little bit more laid out, I will be right back. All right, guys, welcome back. And I figured it was about time that we would maybe do a little bit more building on screen uh, with you guys. So um, what I've gone ahead and done is I've already uh, layered up to the second level here um, of the house. Uh, and I've also added a little bit more uh, structure. Um, I've added where the staircase will be and then a back storage room around there, just so you guys have a good idea. And then um, so one thing you'll notice if you watch Aaron's video is that um, I have flipped all of the wood on the outside. I don't. It's something I've done uh, in the past after uh, building a lot with Ark um, that I just like the look of the finished wood on the outside uh, over the uh, logs uh, on the outside. Um, so that's just one thing that I prefer to do. Uh, but then I figured I would uh, let you guys uh, join in on the fun that is building with Ark. Um, so first thing we're going to, oops, that's not the right one. We're going to go ahead and put in these pillars here. And I've already laid out the uh, fence foundations um, for where all of that is going to go. Um, and then this area that I'm doing right now, I just want to make sure that I'm snapping to the right point here, uh, is going to be our uh, area for our forges. Um, to uh, help out with um, metal production in the uh, what? Why didn't couldn't I go there? There we go. Uh, to help out with my metal production, so I'll put all the forges in there uh, with a uh, storage bin at the back uh, to store unsmelted ore. Um, and then over here, we need to add in a door frame right there and a wall right here um, and then as you can see this is kind of a little back storage area uh, and then here's going to be the tricky part is getting the snap point to the oh, there it was for a second boom right there and right there awesome so now whoop, too fast so now we have the ramp to get us up to the second level. Now, what would have been really cool is in S plus, you can actually change the ramps to staircases. Um, so that would have looked really, really cool, but uh, we're just doing vanilla. And then also, oh my gosh, actually, hold on. I like the lower one better. Let's see if we can get this side to match up with that one. There we go. That looks better. All right. So we've got most of the, or we've got pretty much all of the structural stuff uh, done on this bottom level. So now we need to start building the ceiling, which will end up being the floor to the second level. Now this might be a little bit difficult um, just because the snap points in this game are unbelievably tough to navigate. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start on this side. And we might want to actually just bring Shaggy in. Can you fit through a dino gate, Shaggy? Nope, you can't. All right, so just kidding. We're not going to bring Shaggy in. We are just going to start right there and we're just going to start building as much as we can off of the base of this um, and I'm just going to because the tricky part with arc is that the snap point is key and if I really want my OCD to not get murdered um, when building an arc, I have to build 
as much of it from a single snap point as possible. So now that we've got... Nope. All right. Um, maybe... Are we still good? See, right there. You see that? So right there. See, as I move it, there's a possibility that it could snap to that instead of that. It's very subtle, but if you look at the edge on the top of my screen, that's that's where the problem in lies. But it looks like it worked okay. Now there is a little gap here, but that'll be all right. Let's hop over here because it does stick out over on that just a little bit. But now you see, now that I'm up here, it wants to snap to the wall instead of what I've already been building. And that is that is the joy of building with Ark. Um, it's it's so finicky, and and you just have to make sure that you have everything aligned the way you want. so that it's not messing up. Oops, that's the wrong There we go. Now it looks like it's gonna stick out the front just a little bit, but that's okay. I'm all right with that. That'll look, I think that'll look pretty good. Um, so we're just gonna continue to build, cover up the rest of this here. And there you can see, there we go. And again, find the right snap points. And again, because it wants to snap to that outer wall instead of the ceilings that I've already built. And actually, it looks like it actually looks like these ceilings that I placed before something like that happened. So we're gonna go ahead and get rid of those. And let's see if we can't get these built the right way. I wish the destruction wasn't so ridiculous here. All right, so I think if I want the exact, I think because that is to that wall, that one's to there. So I'm cycling through all the snap points to make sure that it's the one I want. And there we go. And then keep going with this guy. Awesome. And one more. And like I said, we gotta make sure. Otherwise my OCD is just gonna kick in. And one in there, one in there, and we'll finish off over here too. Does that look the same? There it does. Awesome. Oop. I'm out of ceilings on me, but that's okay. I built another one, I guess. <laughs> there and then we're actually going to go out to Shaggy here building in the dark with Shaggy uh, actually Shaggy has no more ceilings can we build another one nope can't build another one so we've got a few more in the supply chest here oh, we're just going to grab half of those even though we only need like three or four enter the dark close this last bit up here now this is where I mean it's either gonna snap it's either gonna snap to this wall or this wall or there's a wall underneath here so this is where you really have to make sure everything's lined up the way it's supposed to be oh my gosh It's 
look here. I think, I mean, ugh, it bothered me. This one's not the same as all the other ones. What about on this side? They all they all stick out, right? Yeah, they all stick out. So that means that somewhere in here, it's not exactly. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this. And we're gonna do this. And we're gonna place this one down so that it matches. This one down, and we can't see anymore. And I think I put my torch on Ajax. Gotta love, gotta love the night. My torch? No, I don't have a torch. I don't. Okay, then we're gonna do the cheater way. Hold on one second. There we go. Now we can see. <clears throat> gamma up, so you can see better. All right, now, actually, uh, it looks like it worked. The true test is up underneath because all of these little trusses will line up if you do it right. Actually, looks like we're good to go. So that is the whole first level. Um, we've got a lot of storage area, a lot of crafting area. Um, Got ourselves a little nook. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with that yet. Um, but now it's time to start working on the uh, second floor. So I will uh, do a little bit more framework. And then uh, we will be right back. And welcome back, guys. We have laid out, or I guess I have laid out the um, one side here. Uh, and made sure that I got everything built the right way um, so that uh, when I build this side over here, which is completely naked, <clears throat> that uh, you guys can see uh, the process here. Uh, so the first thing I want to do is I want to get this door frame put in here the correct way. Let's see here. Where's the correct? snap point there it is and then a slope ceiling wrong one there we are um, and now what we do is we take this guy and make sure that we have the correct nope that's not the right one <clears throat> let's try this again uh, let's see if we can get Is there another snap point? Is that nope? That's still wrong. Jeez. Okay. All right. Well, <clears throat> it's hard to tell. There we go. Can we, okay, we can make two more, so we're good. All right. So then we put that one on that side, that one on that side, and then above a roof and sloped one. And slope two. Can we build one? Okay, we can't build one more. And then what we need to do is come over here and make sure that we have the correct. There we go. Correct snap point there. There. No, that is incorrect. And this this is the joy right here, folks. This is living the dream right here. All right, so let's try this again here. Nope. That one there, good, and good, and then, oops, wrong, come on, there we go, there's the right one, do that, do that, do that, and there, that side, oops, built another one of those by accident, alright, so that's that, and actually, we do need more. I need one, two. So we're going to go ahead and come over here and make sure we have... Nope. 
Not there. No. Can't tell. There we go. And then... Do we have any more on Shaggy? The window frames? No. I mean, I can build more. Okay, we're dehydrated. All right. Joy of building. You forget to look at your food and water. Any more window frames? Okay, good. Oh, that was weird. All right. And you know what? While we're down here, let's just see if we can't get these lined up. Nope. We're going to have to do it up there. <laughs> Gosh dang it. This is what I love about building an ark. It always keeps you on your toes. All right, so let's get back to this side here. There we go, and finish off with a wall. Perfect. And this guy, get rid of him. And let's put, you know what, because it's easier to make a wall. Yeah, that's what we want. We want a wall. There it is. Alright, and then... There. And there. Perfect. Okay, so we've got all that done. Now, the next order of business is to put some sloped ceilings on here. Oh, and this area right here is what leads us up into the third floor. So we're going to try this. <laughs> nope, no good. Alright. What we're, I'm going to do to show you what we did is we're going to hop on Achilles here for a second. And uh, essentially what we've made is a little enclosed staircase area there. It's kind of hard to see. But the uh, staircase will go right inside of there. So we'll hop off of Achilles. We'll get rid of all of these guys. And then... We don't have our sloped ceilings or staircase. So we're gonna go grab those real quick. Achilles land. Achilles land. There we go. Alright. So we're gonna go grab some sloped ceilings and our stone staircase. Uh, sloped staircase. Okay, so let's start off with installing the staircase so that you guys can kind of see what I'm dealing with here um, when I'm doing these things. As, as I build, I'm having to find the correct snap point. So as you can see, as I place something like the staircase, there's about a million different ways I can, and actually it's, get, it's hard to see again. There we go, let's bring that down just a little bit. It There's like a million different ways to snap this in place so what we want to do is we want to look at the place where we want it and then there's a button on the keyboard in this case q but every platform has a different way of doing it of switching through your um snap points so i want to go ahead and snap it to uh the correct uh point that i want however oops wrong button before we do that can we build a ramp. What do we need? We need some fiber. Okay. Or do we have... I don't think we have a spare ramp. Do we? Shaggy, do we have a spare ramp? We do not. So... Fiber? Is so six enough? I don't even remember. Yeah, it was. Alright. So, from building in the past, I know that there is a pitfall to the circle staircase the vanilla circle staircase the s plus puts this magical barrier around you on the staircase um, however the vanilla one does not so what we have to do to make sure that we don't get trapped in our own building is put a ramp down underneath the staircase because you can fall down inside of there and that's definitely not what you want to do. 
So then, now we have that done. Now it's time to put some ceilings on the build here. So we're gonna go ahead, hop over here, and there's only one snap point, so we're good there. Good there. Now here's where we gotta make sure we're doing the right one because it'll want to snap to both and then nope we want to stay coming from this one side okay, there's only one snap point there oh hold on wait a minute I think I done goofed I mean we'll see but I may have messed that up slightly because there's a slight overlap. And of course we can't go outside and see that, but that's okay. And it's raining. How wonderful. Okay. So we've got the start of our ceiling going. Um, I don't want to go any higher because this is a three-story house build. So I'm going to be uh, making a third level up there. So that's all the further I'm going to go on that second level. Um, and like I said, uh, we're going to have a little bit more advanced technologies like the fabricator and stuff over here. And then in here, is, I think I'm just going to make it the uh, essentially the dining hall or mess hall. We'll have a big old grill, some tables and chairs. Actually, you know what else I could do? I could do this while I'm here. Boom. And boom. All right, so now the only way to get to those on that side at this point is going, oops, is going to be to hop on Achilles. And we're going to try this tactic. Pop up. Ah, oh, missed it. So we're going to have to go again here. Come here, Achilles. Try this again here. What if I just fly right into this and then not hop? There we go. Ah! Inside again. And of course, he's where I need to be. Anyway. Oh, I think we might be onto something here. Bear with me for one second, see if we can do this. Actually, it'd just be easier if we went this way. Duh. There we go. All right, and one slow through there, and one there. All right, thank you, Achilles, for your unneeded assistance. So I am going to continue to work on this. I'm gonna have to build, take, get rid of you, take these, and actually probably hop around here to see how many more ceilings. I better have a lot more stone ceilings in here. Okay, good. Um, you get some more ceilings up on here so we can get going on the third level of the uh, build here. And uh, once I get that all taken care of uh, and laid the framework out of that, um, I will come back and show you guys. Oh, it would help if I had the ceilings on the hot bar. How many snap points do I have here? Oh, I want that one. And I want. Not that one. Okay. So that's all taken care of. Like I said, I gotta lay out the framework for the top, and then once I've gotten that taken care of, um, we will be back and hopefully just be able to put some finishing touches on uh, the structure. And we will have our home new base ready to go. All right, guys. Welcome back. And we have one half of the uh, third floor uh, blocked out and ready to go. So we're just going to continue on, finish up the other half here. 
Uh, we're gonna put a couple window frames here, a couple walls down. And another wall, and another window frame. Can we not build one? Oh, come on. Um, we do need one of those, one of those. Um, so we need one more window frame, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try this. Sometimes you can get away with doing this. Demolish, get the resources. Nope, not yet. How about one more? There it is. Alright, so we took our two extra walls there, and we got that done. Alright, now the last thing we need to make this um, pretty much complete is the most fragile portion of the build. Now, you have to get these right because they are so expensive and I've actually, I don't know where to get any more crystal. So I'm actually minus a door right now, but I will eventually find us a door and put a door on this. But we need to install the front porch area. So doesn't look to be like there's too much, so we're just gonna do this. And put one more on top of it. There we go. And then the door frame. Oh my gosh, seriously, what is this? I don't know what's going on. Something's not right, because it shouldn't, it shouldn't look like that. What happens if I do a wall there? The wall does the same thing. All right, how do we get to that one? That one looks the best. Oh God, it's so ugly. Oh my gosh, okay, so here we are. No, I don't wanna, it's, uh, it hurts my ears, number one, but number two, it's so expensive. All right, so now, it has to come down to that roof, I'm thinking. No. Is it? Oh my gosh, this is, the wonders of arc ladies and gentlemen all right do we have we don't have a stone ceiling on us can we reach you from here no there we go how about now stone ceiling perfect awesome okay and let's put the stones that's stone i want the stone ceiling all right can we match it up that looks right. All right, so it's not going to be perfect and it's going to bother, but, but I, you know, it'll be okay. We'll live. We'll make it through this. All right, so um, we're going to go ahead and put all that stuff back on him for now, um, just so that we don't accidentally use it all right so now we need to roof this off so i guess it would have i could have just grabbed the roofs while i was on there and we don't have any more regular stone roofs so we're just gonna finish this guy off with some slope roofs Oop, fell down the stairs a little bit there Sides. We gotta put the slopes on these guys here. Boom. And come on. Give me the other one here. There it is. And one, two, and we'll go ahead. 
ahead and just cover these up while we're out here. Awesome. And then we'll put the one. No. Okay, so here is where my OCD goes nuts. Come on. There it is. I'm going to test something here. I think I know what I did wrong. Let's see here. Yep, that's what it is. So, when building sloped roofs, make sure that you start your sloped roofs from the same side. Start one from one side and one from the other. Start from the same side. Alright, so, come back over here. Do this again. Does that line up? It does. Alright, well, on the plus side, we could make three more of these. Oops. So we just need one more roof. Uh. Resources on you, sir. Oh, we do. Okay. All right. So we can come back up here, finish this guy off, and bada bing, bada boom, we're done. All right. So now, we'll hop back down here to Shaggy. And we're just going to get rid of all of the stuff that we don't need. And we don't need this at all, so we're just going to get rid of that. Uh, transfer, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. Boom, boom, boom. And it's fence time. All right, so what I like to do is to prevent myself from doing almost what I did earlier is to put railings around these areas so that we don't run there we go into falling off so that's one thing so now I can just walk around fine there and then we want to do the same thing out here now okay come on there we go There we are, now we have our little outpost area. Good to go there. And then as I look around on the inside, this is good to go over here. And then down here, we're good to go all around here. Now the last thing, and it's purely aesthetic that Aaron does in his video, I'm not super worried about it is he goes through and okay we do have a couple let's see if we can uh slope there we go and we one what are we out of stone and thatch so we can fix that quickly uh, no we can't okay well here's i'm just going to show you um, so the other thing that Aaron does in his videos, he comes up underneath here and he places um, stone roofs going kind of opposite, oops, kind of like that, and one more. He does that, and then he does it again on this side to cover up that in there. So if I were to do that in here, it would look like that. And actually, you know what? I, I'll give it to him. I like it. It looks clean. Um, so we're going to come over here, and we're going to get... Um, no, we need 
stone and thatch. And can we build one more? All right, so we're good there. And then the final touch, is it on? Or did I not build it? I might not have built it. So come over here and just place this real quick. What? Okay. Really? There we go. Okay. So now the final touch. I didn't build, so we're going to come back over here. And what do we need for a... Oh, we need doors too, I guess. What am I what am I talking about? We need doors. Um, so we're gonna go ahead, get a couple more wood there. Alright, re we need a dino gate. And then we need one, two, three. How many can we make? One? Okay, what do we need? Okay, we need more stone. We're just gonna grab more stone. Um, and D O O. And we're just gonna build four total and then we're just gonna go ahead and pop those down on the hot bar run over here and boom there's that and then we have doors to put on one there One here, one here, and was there not one more? I thought there was one more. Am I wrong? One. No. That's the one thing I really like about the S Plus doors is that they are auto open, auto close. It's so nice. Well, I guess that's all we needed. We didn't need the other one. So we'll put this back on you. And you know what, guys? Other than the uh, mishap with the greenhouse, which we can figure out. Let's figure out if we can't make another. Actually, wait, hold on. Because I don't have the crystal on me. No, I don't. Let's hop over here. Let's get the crystal and cementing paste and the metal off of you. Fly over here real quick. Do, 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 do. Let's take a look. What if we put boop, 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 and structures, greenhouse, oh, three more crystal. <laughs> three crystals. We can make a door now. We need three more crystals. So um, I think that's going to be it for today. Um, let me fly up here and see if there's been some crystal that's respawned. Um, I just happened to come across it just randomly let's see if it's up here again my guess is no and if that's the case we'll just have to fly up to the ice cave and uh, hopefully oh hey look at this so there is some here all right so stay with me here guys we need to come down here to ajax our pick level him up we're gonna keep pumping his health what Where? or did we put him in the box oh, i bet we put him in the box we did put it in the box all right so grab the pick now what's your weight look like oh you can't do anything all right well, let's level you up in the meantime with weight all right, let's go, Achilles. 
pop up here. Let's mine this crystal real quick. And pop that down there. Come over here. 12 crystal. 31 crystal. All right. So we now have 31 more. We might be able to even make a greenhouse door, guys. And then the build will be completely done. Let's just give it a, a flyby. Check it out here. What's it look like? Oh, yeah, that's looking great. Okay. So, fly back over here. We're going to start calling this the beach house, even though we still live on the beach. But... You know, or the Patagonia. Whatever you want to call it. I think I'm just going to refer to it as the beach house. Hop off here. Hop in here. And... Boop. Structures. Greenhouse. Door frame and door. Oh my gosh, that's incredible. Put that there. Put that there. Alright, guys. This is going to be it. This is it right here. You're witnessing the completion of our home base. This is going to be awesome. Get up inside here. Come on. Come on. And get rid of that. It's still not right. I don't want to demolish those. Oh my gosh. It's gonna hurt me. Ugh, it's so ugly. So ugly. And you have to duck to get out of it because it's so elevated. Alright, well, we might be doing some redesign of that, but. It is done. Hop on, get Shaggy out of here. Our mobile supply closet, essentially. Get on Achilles here and let's take a look at this bad boy. Oh yeah, that looks awesome. Let's close, close the front gate. You know what? It's going to be great. Three-story house. We'll be able to add like a porch and a, like a whole walkway around it and everything else. But I think that looks great, guys. Uh, once again, thanks to Aaron Longstaff for the instructional video on how to make this. Um, like I said, I made some minute tweaks. Not really a whole lot. Most of this is directly from his video. Um, but... Uh, be sure to go check out his other builds. They're just all incredible and awesome. And so thanks for joining me today on uh, our episode of Arc Building Evolved is what it felt like for me. Um, until next time, uh, I will see you again. Uh, wow. I see. I never know how to end these. I'm so bad at them. Make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe for more videos. And until next time, I'm, ja I'm JF Kaz. Wow. This is horrible. This is going terribly. I'm JF Kaz, and we'll see you on the next episode of ARC Survival Evolved.